What is up? I'm Moana Turtle, and today we are wrapping up box number two of Battles of Legend Heroes Revenge, the newest set in the Yu-Gi-Oh! TCG. Uh, so far, big fan of this set. Uh, box one, we got some very good pulls, and for the first half of this box, we got almost nothing. So I have super high expectations for this opening. Uh, the things that I want the most would be that Black Luster Soldier, as well as the Al Mirage. However, uh, wouldn't mind another Boral Sword Dragon, that's for sure. And uh, so let's get right into pack number one. We have a White Dragon Wyvern Buster. I do like this card. Unacceptable result from the Fortune Fairies, Solomon Great Sanctuary, Vision Hero Poisoner, and then a High Speedroid Rubber Band Shooter. Have a couple of those at this point. And let's get into pack number two. All right, let's see what we have. We have a Predablast, not familiar with the Predaplants. Shadal Hedgehog, Battle Wasp, Arbalist, the Rapid Fire, Black Dragon, Clap Serpent, and, oh yes, there we go. Uh, that was, this is one of the ones I wanted. A Solomon Great All Mirage. It looks some, like some kind of mech unicorn that actually kind of looks like a rabbit with the horn. <laughs> It's like a rabbit, mech, rap, mech rabbit with wings, like kind of like a pegasus, but it's a rabbit, but with a horn, it's like a unicorn. Clearly, that's what we have there, uh, but very happy with that pull, all mirage. I mean, I feel like we're um, checking off the boxes as far as getting all the cards in this set very quickly. And uh, what the, excusing that minor blip in part one of this box, things are going very well. We have a vision hero, witch raider. Magical Musketeer Max, Sonic Stun, Gimmick Puppet Chimera Doll, and Battle Wasp Hama the Conjuring Bow. Not sure how that's a wasp, but that card looks pretty cool, not gonna lie. Uh, usually a big fan, or not a big fan, but I'm usually, I think like bow stuff is usually pretty cool. I think the, um, in the War of the Spark set for Magic the Gathering, the Oketra, that card always looked cool. Alright, let's see, we have Foolish Burial, Lucky Loan from the Fortune Fairies, Shadal Somata, oh, this might be the first one I've seen of this, what am I looking at? Is this some kind of weird gecko thing? I'm not sure. Summoning Swarm, and then a Necroz Cycle. Don't think that's a good one. <clears throat> Alright, still want that Black Luster Soldier. See? Vision Hero Multiply Guy. The Vision Heroes, I feel like they all look the same. <laughs> so I'm never too crazy, to, uh, too like excited to see them. This guy with his uh, keyboard sword. Yes, very... Of course, why not? Gold Moon Coin. A Battle Wasp Nest. And then a Vision Hero Vion. I think we have a couple of those at this point. With these sets, these five card sets, like... You know, I, uh, so far I'm enjoying this, but I will say that... The amount of cards, like, the set is so small that, you know, except for the one or two secret hits, the rest of, like, the set is, like, you basically collect the whole set in, like, a single box. Which, I don't think is a bad thing, but I do think it makes it a little less exciting to open up, uh, the packs. Alright, Destiny Hero Dangerous, Battle Wasp Pin the Bullseye, and Drag Glubian. <laughs> There's that old looking dragon. Um, but yeah, let me know in a comment down below wh whether you prefer the, you know, nine packs um, with a rare and a secret compared to these all ultra and one secret packs. Um, I feel like I like these in the beginning, but it just gets old very quickly. We have Artifact Sight. I like that card. Shadal Falco, Elemental Hero Stratos, and Artifact Lancia. Okay, not bad, not bad. Pretty cool card. I'm actually going to put this in a sleeve. Uh, so, yeah, I feel like the nine card packs, the ones where like you only get like two secrets per box, I feel like uh, those are better long term. <coughs> These are fun to open at release, uh, but then, you know, then it kind of hype dies down pretty quickly, in my opinion. All right, let's see what we got. We got a Revival Swarm, Water of Life. Dragon Necro Nether Soul Dragon, 
Hmm, is this the first one we have of these? I think it might be. Vision Hero Minimum Ray. That does not ring a bell. And then Utopia Kaiser. This guy is actually not bad. We're going to slap a sleeve on him too. It's a, kind of a weird art, is he? I thought maybe he was holding a pair of scissors, but that's clearly not the case. Alright, I feel like we're still due for one more big hit of a super. I don't think the... Lancia or the type of Kaiser should count. Is that Shadal Beast? Battle Lost Ballista the Armageddon? TG Drillfish? Fortune Fairy Chef? Oh, this might be our first Fortune Fairy so far. Let's get a Blackluster Soldier! Prankatops! This might be Prankatops number four. Still crazy that a card that was very recently a common to be a secret rare and still going for like six bucks. A secret rare for a set like this too, not not like a the secret rare like rarity is so different between these kinds of sets. Will of the Solomon Great, TG Metal Skeleton, Miracle Stone, Summon Limit, and Trap Trick Sarah. Oh, these openings go so fast. <laughs> well, I enjoy it. It's just it's very short lived. Here we go. We got two packs left. Still want one more good card. Vision Hero Trinity, Battle Wasp Az Azusa, the Ghost Bow, Fortune Fairy Sui, Battle Wasp Har a Halberd of the Charge, and boom! Vision Hero Increase. Hmm. Alright, last pack. Let's get some last pack magic. If we don't get one more, this if this pack isn't fire, I feel like... Overall, the box was a bit of a failure. I'm really happy with that Almirage, but I feel like we needed one other hit to make this box worth it. Here we go. All comes down to this. We have a Battle Wasp, Twin Bow the Attacker, Lucky Loan, Vision Release, Number 60 Dugaris the Timeless, and boom! Vision Fusion. So I don't think we did it. Uh, so I feel like this is kind of like a 6 out of a 10 box. But we do have a, hand, a handful of okay. And then one good secret in Solomon Great Al Mirage. If you don't want to take a look, I'll leave it right here for a little bit. Yeah, link one, zero attack. All right, there we go. That's what we're looking for. <laughs> um, so kind of disappointed, not going to lie. But uh, yeah, maybe we'll crack into a third box. We'll see kind of how this video does. Uh, so if you do want to see more... Um, Battles of Legend Heroes Revenge uh, openings, let me know by hitting that like button and uh, letting me know in a comment down below as well. And thanks for watching guys, I'm Moana Turtle and I'll catch you guys next time, peace.